New from KTAL Records, 22 explosive hits. What? Hey everybody, it's me, Steve Schnee, the CD Junkie. On this episode of CD Junkie, I just want to thank all of you for your support. We are almost at 1300. This is the push for 1300. I know you're probably going to look and it's going to say 1297, 1298. But when I wasn't making videos, when I was moving down here and then I had health issues, blah, 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 and I didn't make a video for a month, month and a half, Gosh darn it, it seemed like my my sub count kept going up. Then I started making videos, and then it kind of went, eh, 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 eh. and it got to the point where it was like at 1299, and I thought, okay, just a few more days, and I might hit 1300, and I'll make that video. Then the next day, it was 1298. And then the next day, it was 1299. Then the next day, it was 1297. Eh, <laughs> You know, I mean, that's just the way it goes. That's absolutely fine with me. But I thank you. I thank you for watching this video and for hanging in there with me. I have to admit, the stuff I talk about is not very popular. But that's the music that I listen to. That's the music that I love. Uh, you know, I, I mean, let's touch on a couple subjects right now and get them out of the way. The Beatles revolver. I don't have it. But I'll eventually get it. Uh, MoFi, you know what? Even back in the day when I was buying vinyl, I didn't buy MoFi because I was born with uh, a hearing and uh, vision issues. So there are certain uh, frequencies that I don't hear. So people are always going, oh, this sounds better than that. To me, it all kind of sounded the same because I wasn't hearing maybe the highs or the lows uh, as well as most people. So that's why I never got into audiophile. Hey, let people get into audiophile. Let people uh, praise MoFi or 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 rip it apart, um, and all those other uh, companies that put out great pressings of vinyl. I have no problem with any of that, uh, just as long as they're listening to the music. That's the most important thing. You know, when you're talking about like original pressings versus uh, repressings and all this kind of stuff, talk about the music too. That's really what's really important. Of course, you know, people do just buy stuff you know they'll buy Steely Dan uh, for the sound then they'll buy the Dead Kennedys uh, just to play in the car or you know that really rare seven inch single just because they love the song so much uh, and but hey all that's good as long as people are buying physical product I am all for it a hundred percent it could be vinyl it could be whatever and you know what the old VC the new VC <laughs> that's all nonsense okay it's just a bunch of people who get on the internet and say silly things about records now they may not think it's silly but you know you have somebody who works on Wall Street or you have somebody who's a big sports fan they're gonna get on the net and they're gonna go wow what a bunch of nerds uh, but you know what that's what a lot of us are. A lot of us are proud nerds, uh, whether you love jazz or country or classical. As long as it brings you joy and as long as it just fills you with passion, that's really the reason why all of us should be making these videos. But you know what? Maybe people just are really into just owning certain pressings and it really doesn't matter what's on that pressing as long as it looks good, sounds good, and you know what? All the power to them. At least they're supporting the industry. At least they're getting out there and they're buying physical product, whether it's in a used store or a new store online. It doesn't matter. They're buying it. That's the important thing. Why do we argue about things like this? Why do people attack me for being arrogant or making things about myself. Now, number one, this is my channel, right? I'm not going to talk about things unless I'm excited about them. So, of course, I'm going to make things, quote unquote, about my passion, my joys. If that bothers you, that's absolutely fine. Just don't watch the videos. Go watch somebody else. There's a lot of other people out there that you can moan and complain about. I went through a health scare recently. I'm going through a lot of, you know, different tests. It gives me a different perspective on things. And those fools who sit there and, you know, crap on me or any of my uh, YouTube friends, whatever, dude, or dudette. I'm not going to get into this like, oh, we should all get along. This is a community because a lot of people don't see it that way. You know, a lot of people will look down on me or look down on somebody else and say like, oh, well, he's got terrible taste in music or she's got terrible taste in music. Guess what? Nobody has terrible taste in music. It's 
it's all about what gets you excited and what you love. There should never be a guilty pleasure. It's all about what gets you excited and, and, and what you love about music. That's really what this is all about. It's the only reason I make these videos. It's, it's just to turn people on to music, hopefully. And if it works, fantastic, wonderful. Uh, and if it doesn't work, well, then maybe it worked on somebody else, uh, you know, apart from you. Uh, uh, and, and, and you know what? And I respect people who don't, care for my taste in music that's fine because there are people out there that i don't care for their taste in music but i'm not going to go on the internet and tell them that what's the point of saying anything about it man talk about what you love that's really what this is all about and i love the fact that there are almost 1300 of you that hopefully agree with me i mean maybe out of the 1300 maybe only 18 of you actually actively watch my videos but i appreciate that you know that's 18 people that i have a kinship with that understand my passion and love for music and i understand your passion and love for music we are all here together talking about incredible stuff that, that that motivates us that moves us that brings us to tears that that makes us smile it's the passion in the music. You don't have to have a, a, a channel like I do. You just have to have that love and that passion for music. Talk to your coworker in the next cubicle. Talk to your family members. Just say, man, I really love the song. It, love it, love it. Passion, passion. That's all. It's, that's totally what it's about. Absolutely, 100%. Love and passion. That's what music does to me. Hopefully, it does that to you. And hopefully... You enjoy some of the things that I do here, including Tuesday nights uh, live on my channel when I present This Is Ski Lodge. I have an incredible time sharing all of this stuff with all of you, and I, I really appreciate you. You, you. you have to understand that. You know, sure, I get, there's a lot of stuff I hate, but why waste my time and your time talking about stuff that I hate? Let's talk about stuff we love. And that's what my channel is all about. Uh, you know, and I hope that you stick with me in the long run. I hope I stick around in the long run. Uh, and, uh, you know, I, I hope we get to share more and, and, and bring more people uh, into this uh, little community where, uh, uh, you know, Tuesday nights on Ski Lodge or, or just whenever I post videos. It's just, you know... I have an amazing time doing it. Anyway, that's it. I know that I just kept talking. I appreciate you listening to me. But there are times when, you know, it, it kind of feels pretty decent, pretty okay to be alive. And uh, uh, this is one of those moments for me. So I thought I'd get on. And I talk to you personally. I'm not talking to anybody else. I'm talking to you. So please, thank you for being here. Thank you for uh, experiencing this crazy a VC universe with me. It, it doesn't revolve around me. It revolves around you. It revolves around the viewer, the people that keep coming and 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 watching videos and supporting uh, people like me. That's really what it's all about. It's not me. It's not any of the other channels. It's you. I and hopefully most of the other people appreciate you for hanging out with us. Uh, and uh, thank you, everybody. And uh, remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. Get me up over that 1,300 subscription hump. And uh, we'll hopefully see you real soon with some more videos and obviously more uh, live streams with This Is Ski Lodge on Tuesday nights at 6 p.m. Pacific. And uh, I appreciate you. And we'll talk to you later. That's it for me. I'm Steve Schnee, the CD Junkie.